MRO found a series of uh, layered rocks in a particular region of Mars which have very rhythmic layering to them. And this is really important because it tells us uh, new information about the ancient climate of Mars recorded in the rocks. One of the main ways you turn dirt into rocks on Earth is through the action of water. And you typically need water to cement individual grains of sand or sediment into rocks. And so we know that these um, layers are, are hard rock now. And so it's um, uh, certainly possible that water was involved in, in forming those rocks. One of the really exciting things is that um, these rocks we know now are essentially recording an archive of the past climate. So someday we could go there and actually read the ancient history of Mars in the rocks. And so we know now that there, there is an archive existing on the planet that we could go look at to learn about the ancient climate. So that's a really important thing. And then also tying it into the um, story of climate change and ice ages on the Earth, which are also paced by variations in the planets in the Earth's orbit, um, we may be seeing that that same process happens on Mars. And so it may give us another opportunity to study how climate is affected by um, orbital parameters. And the same way that these oscillations in its orbit cause the ice ages on the Earth, they should affect the climate of Mars uh, in the same way. And so that's one possibility for the cycle that we see recorded in the rocks. And this is sort of a natural rhythm to the planet that the Earth has its own rhythm and Mars has its rhythm. And that may be what we're seeing recorded in the layers.